so I'm on Adelaide Street, I think it's called, just outside the Winter Gardens. Here we go. And the place I'm staying is called the Winter Garden Suites. I've actually stayed on this road before, and if you guys remember, I met some amazing subscribers here. The Adelaide, uh, uh, Adelaide Lodge. I think this is where they stayed, my subscribers. I'll have to look at that video and go back again. But yeah, my, uh, my subscriber David and his lovely family. Oh, look, you've got self-catering holiday flats here as well. So I'm looking for the Winter Garden Suites. So it is on this road, apparently. Okay, got vacancies here. The Iron Cliff. Hold up. The Iron... Oh, no, 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 no. Go the other way. I remember this. You guys remember this one? Apparently a refurbed hotel. Yeah, right. Oh, look at this. Men's pies on arrival on Christmas Day. Christmas Day, nice. For £99 for a night, that's good. Especially for the area right near everything. Oh, Adelaide House, it looks awesome. It's very nice. How are you, okay, love? This place, look, this place looks nice, doesn't it? I'm just, I'm, just, I'm just next door, but this place looks very nice. You not been here? No idea. Right, so the garden suites. I think this is it. God help me. Pray for me. Are you got in here? Uh, yes, sir. Yeah. Oh, oh, God. Thank you. Yes, sir. That's your practice. Yes, sir. Still good on one. Yeah. No, it's a room one. You want room one? Check it out. night? Yes. Okay. It was an apartment, I believe. An apartment room? Yes. Yep, lovely. Yes. Apart one? Yes, this. Mm, the color room one. To this side, right? Yes, this Oh, my God, this side, right? Oh, yes. Okay. Who we'll got this side, right? Okay. Yeah. Lovely, yeah. thank you very much, sir. Else you need to know? So, um, this is blocked because we've got a family coming in. Right, okay. So you have to go through that way. Right, so when I'm coming back in, I have to go from the back, is that right? Yeah. Uh, and it's uh, this key, is it? That's, your, that's the key, just in case them doors, then gates are locked. Right, okay. It's nice one. <laughs> but this is smoke outside. Yeah. Chill. Nice one. Thank you very much. You've been great. Thank you so much, sir. What a nice guy. Right. Let's do some work. Now let's investigate. By the way, I need a poo really bad. Oh, he's gone up there. Okay. First of all, the smell. This. I'm definitely going to need to go to a shop and get some air freshener. I've not even been to the toilet yet. Let's have a look around. Oh, this smell. This smells nice. So this is the bedroom. At least the bedroom smells nice. Okay. Let me just put all the lights on and stuff. Get all this stuff all settled and then I'll make a video for you. So, while I'm still on the subject, I just want to say, um, I've just walked into the bathroom. It's not, it's not bad, it's actually pretty clean. Um, it's not bad at all, it smells okay. Um, however, as soon as I walked in, I can confirm the toilet is spotlessly clean. Um, not for long because I am currently sat on the throne. So I can confirm as soon as I walked in, around the toilet seat, inside, everything was spotless and they had all that blue bleach stuff in there. So really clean, but yeah, not for long. Okay, ladies and gents, is it possible to still get a good place in Blackpool, £30, £20, whatever your budget is. Well, this place over here, I got today for £40. I've got to admit, that's actually a pretty decent price for an apartment. Let's have a look. So you've seen earlier the lovely gentleman, very kind, I must say, very nice guy, showed me around. 
So as soon as you come in, now that is a little bit too low because you're always gonna, yeah, that's gonna be a bit annoying. Could do with a little bit of a clean as well. I mean, there are, it's not that bad, but whatever. Come into the living room. I like the space, it's not too big, it's not too small, it's a very, very cosy, but I love that. That's nice. What is it? Oh, so it's like a little, oh, look at this. Very nice. Let's sit down. Oh, that is comfortable. Oh, that would do wonders for my back. Now, I've also noticed, just over here, spare bed in case mom super wants to come but she's also got a sofa uh, which i believe is a sofa bed as well not a bad start you can sit there watch a bit of tv then you think oh wait hold on there's no tv i mean there's the wife of the tv but oh there's a bit of poetry a man dreamed he was walking along a beach one night with the lord he noticed two sets of footprints during the saddest times in his life However, he noticed there was only one set of footprints. The man questioned the Lord about, I don't understand why, when I needed you the most, you would, you would leave me. The Lord replied, during your time of suffering, when you see only one set of footprints, it was then that I carried you. Wow. Powerful. Lord, grant me the ser serenity to accept the things I can like change. Courage. To change things I can and the wisdom to know the difference. Oh, I love that. So you can come down, take a sit down here. Oh, a little bit of a hard sofa, not the kind of sofa that you want to be um, sitting on for long periods of time, maybe about half an hour to an hour. Maybe you've got some guest over, something like that. But um, it's okay. It's actually very comfortable, but it is very hard to sit on. So... I wouldn't let mum sleep as far. I wouldn't let mum super sleep on this. Mind you got the spare bed over there, so that's pretty good. Anyway, let's have a look at the kitchen. Come on. As soon as I walked in, even earlier, the smell of this kitchen. I mean I have a ten is a two. I don't know if it's that mop bucket, maybe it is. Let's have a look. That looks okay to me. Oh, hold on. The smell is kind of like around here. I don't know if it's the washing machine, but hold on. Oh, I think it is. It's, I don't know how to explain the smell. It just stinks really bad. Nice toys. Okay, a few cups and glasses and stuff. Very nice. Yeah, that smells really bad. Um, you got. Pans and pots, pretty standard. These are what I've just bought from Home Bargains earlier. Peronis in there, nice. Fire. Very good that they are um, one of those places that actually care about fire hazards, unlike the, the Blackpool Hotel on Albert Road, I think it is. That actually, thought I thought for a second... I was going to open this and then I realised it actually wasn't, it's an actual painting. I mean, look, from far, even from an angle like this, doesn't, that does look pretty cool. But again, you can sit down with your missus watching a bit of TV, but there's no TV. It would have been nice to have a little TV, but even, even better, a workstation. You've got a perfect area here. You've got a perfect area just over there. Just a little table to do your work. And plus, what if you get your dinner and you can't really, you can get some chairs, right? Well, there's no chairs in here, but maybe some just nice stools, put some stools here. Use this as a workstation or even better, somewhere to eat your food. Where would you eat your food? You know, isn't it? I mean, you can sit on the sofa, but it's not going to be very comfortable. But anyway, let's look at the bathroom. Now, I have already done a number two, so... Just want to clarify that when I did open this, it was all blue. And in fact, I've even checked this as well. And they've actually got loads of that in there as well. So every time you flush the toilet, it's going to be squeaky clean because they've got the blue stuff in there. Again, um, very small sink, 
very, very small, and I'm, I'm going to have to... I mean, a disabled friendly, I get that. Wheel, yeah, okay, with the wheelchairs, okay, that makes a bit more sense now, but even a sink slightly wider, you can fit all your stuff on. But uh, I suppose I can just sit on the toilet seat and brush my teeth, but they should have the option. Even this disabled friendly, it should have at least something a bit wider and uh, just test the water. It's as hot as that way. It's ice cold. Okay, that's getting warm. Yep, yeah, that's warm enough. Not bad. Now, I did have a little bit of an accident earlier. I want to be true. I'm not going to blame the rush. I'm not going to blame the apartment. I'm going to blame me. But I had a spillage accident. Don't worry, I didn't wet the floor with my urine. Uh, I actually put the shower on, and here are a few issues. So you turn the wall on, your toilet roll is going to get uh, wet. The height of that isn't that good. So a little bit higher, maybe half an inch, it would ensure the water doesn't leak out. Um, another thing that bothered me was, you know, it's not even pointing that way, but it still makes everything wet, even with the curtains closed. So that's a little bit of an issue. But now this is what concerns me. I mean, that's as much playtime as you have with that playroom, not playtime. There we go, just look at that, it's... It's normally meant to go all the way across, no? Yeah, that's, that needs a lot of work doing. Okay, it's coming out a little bit warm. Yeah, that's okay. Not hot, I'm not gonna lie, it's not piping hot. Good pressure though, and it's clean. Yeah, that's okay for a shower, I suppose. But again, I like my showers nice and hot in the morning, but I'm guessing that's the only hot as it gets to, and then it doesn't turn anymore, then you've got cold, hot. It's just really flimsy, but it works. Some nice uh, shower gels. Let's be turned around. Mason and Miller, not bad. Right, on to, I mean, come on. On to the bedroom. Very nice. Now, first of all, bedroom. It smells really nice, it's very refreshing. That door opened it by itself, and I was just thinking what's going on, but it's okay, it's the wind. Here's the bedroom. Oh, 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 oh. Is that a Ferrero Rocher? Oh, you absolute legends. You've just scored a point with Prash Super. Carpet, clean. Just a few dark spots there, not too bad, but yeah, very clean. What's well, cupboard here? Oh, wow, okay, so you've got extra stuff in there. That's useful. Extra... Pillows, blankets, towels, extra. That's really good. Hangers, not bad. Right, we need to do a bed test, don't we? Let's have a look. I don't want to sit on the Ferrero Rocher. Let's just uh, push that aside. Push that aside there. And you've got a smart TV. Netflix. We'll test that in a second, but most important of all, That's comfortable. Yeah. That is super good. Let's have a further investigation. Mattress topper, got a few stains. However, the mattress, spotless, let's have a look. So, with the actual mattress topper, you can see if you look, this looks like makeup to me. 
Let's have a look. There we go. Yeah, that could easily be quite could be makeup. Besides that, the rest of it's okay. Oh, what's that? Another bit of make what is it? Is it makeup? Is it sweat? What do you guys think? But bear in mind you've got this to cover it, which is good because then you've got the mattress topper. But the actual mattress spot on. Absolutely spot on. Well, perfect everywhere. I don't like having to make the bed up again, but you know what? For you guys, I'm showing you how good this place is. Personally, with the mattress topper, I would get another one. That's just my personal opinion. It's, it doesn't cost that much. Because there are some people that don't want to be sleeping on that, but at least you're not only protected, you're protected twice because you've got the bed sheet, the mattress topper, and the mattress is absolutely spotless. So, not a bad start at all. The shower, meh, yeah, it's one of those, but... Oh God, one sec. Yeah. I actually think I'm gonna get a good night's sleep tonight. It's nice and quiet as well. So the winter garden suites, not a bad location either. You should just step out and you've got everything nearby. I've even got the tower fisheries, if I'm not mistaken. That's not far, that's about six, seven minutes walk. Uh, Ardwick pub should be about 10 15 minutes but we're gonna have a walk anyway later we'll have a little walk around see what's around and uh let's go back to the living room before i get too comfortable on this bed because that bed is lovely heaters everywhere as well but this room is nice and warm I've got to be honest the room is very nice and warm okay so issues with the bathroom that needs sorting but it is producing hot water, so I'll give them a point. But I will have a point down for that because you need... What if you want it even more hotter? What if you want it even more colder? You can't really have much playroom there, so... Um, another thing is I do understand this needs to be flat because it's disability friendly. Right, what's that? Oh, it's just chipped off a little bit. That's okay. Um, I do understand the wheelchairs and stuff like that. I get that. But then on this side, a wheelchair person's not going to need this. So this needs to be higher up, maybe... Just, to, you know what? That needs to be flat, I get that. This, however, if it was a higher up, you'll be okay because then the water won't have to rush out. So I've got to be very careful when having a shower. Um, sink, I get it, wheelchair friendly. That's why it's low, not bad, not a problem. Um, however, get a bigger sink. You can barely get everything on there. Second thing, beautiful little living room, very basic, straight to the point. However, personally, I think you can get a nice table there. A nice table in the corner for two or three people at least. Somewhere you can sit down, enjoy your dinner. But we've got a bit of an Austin Powers thing, babe station thing going on, so let's have a look. Groovy baby, do you want to come to my shag pad baby? Wow, I feel like I'm on babe station, hold on. Shoes off. Is this how they sit down babe station? Hello caller, what's your name? What are you wearing? What you want to do to me? It doesn't need to be here. But it is fun and it is bloody comfortable. Oh, that's doing my back some really good right now. Oh, that's decently comfortable, but it doesn't need to be here. Unless maybe there is a bit of babe station stuff going on here. I don't know. Nah, that smells good. It's been looked after. But you don't want to be doing the naughty on that. <laughs> 